Hey, how's everybody doing? It's me, Robert from Top Stock Market Picks. You know what? Decided to open up my own trading room because whatever. Hey, I'm just a good old New England boy. What can I say? I don't know. Like, it's crazy. I was on the phone. Next thing you know, I'm out the door. But that's okay. I'm the type of guy, my trading room, I don't allow swearing. I mean, if you say it once, twice, three times, that's fine. But four times in one day, I'm going to... Next day, I, I don't. I just don't go for that. Other thing is, I like helping people. Out. Someone's got a thing with different things. I use one program. All right. I don't use four different programs. Too much of me. I like one program. I like it. I want to do my own research on the news. I don't want to trust anybody but myself. But everyone has their own opinion. I like that. That's it. So that's I'm going to stop my own room. Going to be a little different. To the point of, it's going to be a lot different and unique, but just wanted to share that, guys, with you. So, remember now, the other thing, too, is you want to make sure, when you click on a link, you're going to go to where I'm going to bring you to, where it's safe and secure. Security's number one. But, after the net, let's, I'm going to show you guys how I get my stocks. What do I do in the morning? First thing I do, what do I get by four in the morning? I see what the market is doing. I see what sectors are popping. In that sector, then I analyze what stocks are popping. Just want to bang this video out. <coughs> I got a doctor's appointment at 12.45. So I'm going to run this out of here at 11.18 a.m. in the morning today. All right, so let's rock and roll. Let's lock it up and let's go. All right, first thing you want to do is see how the market's moving. That's when I launch my, um, that's when I go here and go to my sector. So right now we can see healthcare, technology, and that. So those are things I like to look at. Um, take a snapshot of the screen. All right. That's what I like to look at as well as volume. Again, healthcare and energy and consumer. So healthcare and energy. Energy probably has six stocks. But now, so I know it's healthcare. So now I'm going to go back. Now, first thing we want to do is we want to look at healthcare. We got that. So whether or not we want to do um, three boxes or vice versa. What I want to do is I'm going to move a box, put it up here. Usually it's in the bottom, but put it up top. All right, now, what we can do up top is have two charts up top. I can split this in half in a dual way. But for now, you can have two John. But for now, I just want one big one. All right, so there's our one big chart. So first thing I do is I'm going to come in here. I have a lot of preset ones. But like I said, I like to show people what to do. So we're going to build a chart. All right, first thing I want to do, I'm going to come up here where you see them. In fact, you're not going to see the mouse. All right, I'll have to... I come up to these little things where it says the 10 minute, you see the little can, the little bars, you're gonna click on that. <coughs> and I come down here, open this up, change it to white. Um, I like to add this 100. <coughs> and after that, boom, we got that done. Uh, um, obviously we can throw some charts, some uh, columns in. Uh, I like to do eight coin value. I like to come over here and do the volume. I'll do this first. Come up again. We'll get yeah, so we'll put this over here. And I'm gonna show you guys how I change it over here to edit. Change the color to white and change it to that. Everything's good there. Save it. Come over here. Same thing. Right, everything's good. Boom, now you got everything right. 
come down, move this down. We're going to add a couple other indicators that I like to add. Just to make this easier for me, <clears throat> what I like to do for this one is just, it's easy, so you don't get all messed up. Just W, R, S, I, space, then M, A, and then five. No, actually get rid of that. And then what? And come over to this one. <clears throat> Put it in there. Bam, you got that. I'm going to throw volume in for you guys and girls and muscular babes. Let's see, we'll do that. I'm going to throw volume in. Volume line, I'll change it. If you want the vine, but we don't, yeah, I'm just showing you guys, you don't need the acorn, but that's what I go by. Yeah. All right, so you guys can have that there. I'm just showing you guys. All right, it's up to you guys. You guys do what you want, but I'm just giving you what I do. All right, got that all set. So, right off the bat, boom, you're coming in. We know what the market is. All right, well, we want to make a scan for what, what sectors we like. So to go in, I already have a pre-built scan, but <clears throat> TC2000 does come with some pre built I already showed you guys how to do those videos. Um, today, I'm going to be walking you through kind of customizing some new ones and different things like that. We're just going to break it down to some other things you can do with just regular thing. First thing everybody likes to do is volume, price, and everything simple. You guys already know how to do add a volume and everything. I already told you, you come in, you click on this, and you can <laughs> modify it. Some people say, well, can you do this? Can you do that? <clears throat> well, we're going to do that. So, we're going to click on this. All right. Like I said before, you don't need a lot of room here. I'm going to make some more room here. All right, because everyone says, oh, can I do this? Can I do that? You can do whatever your heart desires. First thing you want to do is go and change this to U.S. stocks. All right, and we want to add a price. Uh, someone has put a message in one of my videos. Sent me a message. So we're going to do this. Now... This will give us 19 stocks, which is a pretty good price. 19 stocks, only two of the red. That's pretty good with buzz by them. So definitely, that's the first thing I do when I wake up in the morning is check that. Okay. You can change the name. It doesn't matter. The second scan I want to show you guys is one, and a lot of you might get it confused. Um, um, first thing that I like to do is set volume for different stocks. I mean, now don't forget, we can do that same scan and I'll duplicate them. Let's see, I can do the same scan 
I can do the same scan for penny stocks. All right, here you go now. See, we got that same scan there for penny stocks, but I did the penny stocks here. All right, that's no problem. Obviously, you see, we have a lot of volume, and usually I'm going through and looking at all these. All right, so a couple of tricks. The way you want to do volume depends on what you guys want. If you guys want and girls want stocks, at a certain percent, myself, I mean, I'm, I want to look at stocks that are going to give me 50000 in volume. It's whatever you guys want. But we can do volume. Let's do greater than 50000 <clears throat> Let's do that for now. So 156 stocks. You see what we can get with that amount of volume. I brought it down to 28. <laughs> so the pre-built scan they give you is awesome. You guys can do a lot. I mean, you can see what's high, um, what's high in buzz volume. So let's look at this one. So now if you guys don't need all this, it's easy. You can just, actually what you could do is pin it to the side. And when you want it, you just put it down. And you pin it to the side. And then when you want it, it just comes in. And when you don't want it, pin it to the side. So, that's another cool trick I like to use. But, um, anyways, let's take a look at this, uh, at this one. This stock right here. We got a close-up of it. We know it's a U.S. market, which you guys can do that. And I'm looking at the penny stocks. All right, now I got penny stocks on that. Um, in fact, we'll name this, just going to name this. You're going to hit rename, and we're just going to type in U, oh, USA. And there you go, U.S. stocks. Bingo. All right. Just, put the, uh, just do that. We'll do U.S. stocks. And then, of course, <laughs> this one we're just going to change to short abbreviation. Bingo. <laughs> there you go. So, looking at these, we can go down. And we can, now we're getting the market. <laughs> now I'm all set. Same thing here. So now I know the sector I want to go to next. It's going to be what? And then, of course, I'm going to put... Alright, so now we're going to go in now. Change this to up here. And we're going to type in H for healthcare. Healthcare services. We're going to click that. And I come up with 12 stocks in the healthcare industry. And we're looking at them now. See how we got the healthcare in? All right. See what we got? And we're coming down. Now, we got a good one here. We can look at it. And if I want more room, I can post this. Post this up top. <laughs> Bring it down. 
All right, so we can look at this. And this is pretty good. We had a nice candle up here where the bulls brought it up and then came down. So we got it right here, a nice candle, right there, that red one. Look how it's done. Now the white, getting ready to pop here. So this is a good indicator. It's all a flat line there. You know what I'm saying? So that's a good thing. But definitely, they were keeping, they keep, they was keeping the price up. <laughs> and we're gonna drive it up more. They wouldn't let us, dropped us down and look what we did. It's pretty good. So this is interesting to watch for the day. So this is definitely one, two, one. Keep on the chopping block. Because I think this is definitely going to be a pretty good spike up. I think today this is probably going to hit about, this is a $4.75. I think it's going to run up, which is a good thing, I believe. I should hit that today about there. Or around there, but definitely look at that candle hitting the sweet spot. But I'm definitely going to keep my eyes open on this one. This is a good one. Going to add it to my uh, wish list. But I'll do that in a minute. Next thing I wanted to do is make the second skin, the one I use all the time. And I'm sure you guys know of it. Nope, wrong one. That's Omega and I oh, yeah, no. <coughs> all right, hold on. I'm gonna show you guys how I get this one. All right, so we're gonna, we're gonna break another bar up. Hold on. All right, so now this is all U.S. stock, same over here. So I come on, I got 79 now. We'll hit those by him. Now these are the ones that are my like top. My top gain is this list right here. Is my top gain is all right. It's like everything else I'm fit. So we got this dock here. So I use two different scans, but this helps me with the sector. So now I'm gonna go in now and change this to healthcare, as you guys can see. But when I make the next one, next one's gonna be penny stocks. It's easy to do. I think I showed you guys this, but then again, I'll show you again. Um, in fact, I'll just show you the code. It's so much easier just to put the code in. Just like this, you're gonna go. And you got your news right here. All right, so as you can see here, we got 50%. So now all you're gonna do to get this, 
<laughs> now, of course, we're going to change that to um, 50,000 in volume. That's a pretty good number to go with, is 50,000 shares or 30,000 shares. But looking at how the market's been going <laughs> and stuff like that is good. I'm going to show you guys another scan that I do. But So in order to do this, we're just going to go like this. We're just going to type the word P-R-I-C-E. P, and you're just going to look for that. <clears throat> you can copy and paste this and, and do anything with it and add another formula unless you guys actually put the whole formula in. But <clears throat> there's two ways you guys can do it. To do 50%, you can do it here. All right, and what that's going to give you is what we already have. 50% <clears throat> right on. All right. So now they'll do this. Now I'm going to take it 90 stock. So so there we go. So we got our stock. So now we got it set in two ranges. We got 50% and the top gainers. This will open up the market a little more and give us some better stocks. And as you can see, it really does help out with this gainer. So this is the first thing I do in the morning. I see... <coughs> what stocks are in the penny sector and the US stocks. But right now I got healthcare here. So then we put healthcare in this one. All right, we're gonna do healthcare. All right. Now you guys are probably asking, well, So another people try and ask, so what do you do? Because this is at 90% and then this one's at 50%. Can I do that the same with the pre-built scan that comes with TC2000, which you guys know as going this way with it. <laughs> you can do whatever you want with this scanner here. If you want to do penny stocks and, and do the price, you can and I'm going to do the price you guys can do that and I'm going to show you what you can do with it <clears throat> alright you guys can do this and get 180 stocks with volume on them ok I'm just going to throw this down here in this window here alright so another way if you guys want that's a lot. All right. Now, if you want, you guys can bring it up to full. Yeah. <clears throat> so he went from 180 and nothing changed when you did full. <clears throat> All right. So you guys can do what you want. But. See, that won't change nothing. See, a better off leave it there. But if you want to do the stocks between 50% and down, you can do that. But the other thing we got to do, obviously, if we look at this, we got a lot of hundreds in there. So, basically, all right, you can come over here. It depends on what you guys want to do. What I like to do first <coughs> is just see what the stocks are doing under a thousand but I rather sometimes I'll do five thousand shares I want to see what stocks are moving up five thousand shares now that will take that 190 and bring it down watch 190 bring it down 190 we brought it down to 12 so we had 190 190 minus 112 78 stocks, so we brought it down to 78 stocks. <clears throat> so now we got that. So basically we got super active. So then I can come over here if I want, and then we can go up to say we want to do 75%. 70. Oh. 
112. So with this type of scanner, you know, you just leave it at 50. All right. All right, that's what you do. So basically, you just leave that there with the, with the pre-built ones. You just leave it there. Now, as you can see, I'll show you another scan that I actually use for penny stocks in my pre-built list. Um, just be called penny stock. Let me see if this is on. Oh, that's debt to ratio. That's a pretty good one. I tweet. Wonder if the ones that I got in there are the same. Yeah, this is another one I built. Um, yeah, right here. So, <clears throat> volume 5,000, debt to ratio 4.1. Dollar ratio you can do. Maximum beta, we could probably bring that up to 50. So you guys can do what you want with that. So you got that. Oh, I'm trying to think about that. What is that penny stock skin? So I'll put that link in bottom of the uh, video. See max 251.1 and V greater than 300,000 and 0 0.01 equals C and C left. So there you go, that's that. And there you go. And do whatever you want to do. Want to change the volume to three hundred thousand? You can. Want to change it to a thousand? You just go in there and go one. Oh, we could also do 200,000. Might be good, 200,000. We can do 250,000, but we can do that. So this is a good scan. It gives you, like, good stocks. Now, as you can see, we got some nice ones. So 
That's a scan I do use. I'm gonna put the uh, description down below, actually. I'm gonna put that right in the script. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna put the link to my website and I'll have that go to my website. All right, don't forget to sign up for the free, free newsletter. I send out. It's every six months quarterly, so definitely enjoy it. All right, thank you. Peace out. Enjoy this video. Hope everything is good. God bless. But that's what I do. So get rid of this. And now we're going to go here now and get. Healthcare. <laughs> so we got our time, we got our health care here, Spike. We got our pink sheets here. All right, but we don't need them. So we got that there. So you can get rid of this scan. You really don't need this. All right, we just want these two right here. And we cannot all watch this. So what I like to do is just grab today's date, which is Tuesday. And I should have one already made up Tuesday. <coughs> Thursday. So click on Thursday. Show you guys my new toy. It's a nice program I'll show you. I'm gonna give you guys a link to this because I like it. Tuesday. I'm gonna send you guys a link to this program. It's all awesome. fact, I think I did a video on it. But anyway, let's get back over to here, get the soul squared away here. So we can put our list in here. Okay, we'll get our list right here. Good, we got a list right here. Oh, we're going to come in and straighten that out. Now we got a watch list. <clears throat> so we're looking at this, and obviously, everyone's gonna be different. Now, like I said, this is the 50%. If you guys wanna do 50% or 90%, so it doesn't matter if you guys want that, just pick the 50%. But we got 11 stocks here. And as you can see, most of these are hitting up here. So you do have all the stocks that are in play. If we do alphabetical order. All right. I mean, we have some of them lining up. And that's it. So we have this one and this one. So that's what I'm saying. Some people like to do price, alphabetical, <coughs> volume, or buzz volume. I'd rather go with buzz volume because that's the whole week of volume. But anyway, so go with this one. As you can see, we got some ones in here. Um, another good one here. Um, oh, let's go back to that one. Let's 
What did I tell you? Look, I put the mark right there. Where is it going? <coughs> yep, it's right around that area. So the white candle's coming up. Now this could definitely pop up in volume. And see if I just want to add volume. And look at that data volume pushed up. But the bears kept it down. We had volume, but the now we're coming up here. Got that little answer. This definitely one I want to add to my watch list. I'll just hit add to watch list. Now we'll just type in Tuesday T U E. I know I can. But definitely this one. I'm going to go down. <coughs> That's a good one right there, Candle. So see, we've got a lot going up. As you can see, we've got a nice format up here. Coming up. I have a breakup. So this is a good one to... We're actually going to what it is. Alright. So that's a good one. And we're looking at that. So if I want to add that, I can just add it. But the other way that might be better to do this is just to get our flag list. It'd be easy. So what I mean by our flag list is right here. I got nothing in it. Come over here. Go RTR. said I don't probably don't even need this volume because I want more news I don't I want more news so what I'll do is I'll get rid of I don't all I want is the price I already got the volume here so basically what I'll do is I'll just come over here and I can get rid of these two and get more news so that's what I would do I would come over here I'll just get rid of that and then I want more news all right so I can, all right so bingo so now I got a little bit more news so I want this, all I have to do is just flag it. <coughs> and same thing with this one, just flag it. And it's good. Same thing over here. Now this one, everyone's been on the market with this one. Now as you can see, this is one you definitely wanna keep your eyes open. Now some people wanna short that. Now see also, when a message comes in, I can get it, all right? The difference between other trading rooms out there is they just have one big chat room everyone can go in. With this, we can kind of individually have a private group of, say, 25 people. Most people join a chat room, they just throw you into the lion's cage. Well, we want to get you comfortable with what you want to do. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm trying to do here is just show you different things about technology but anyways so you can just flag them now this one's been on everyone's radar as you can see I mean a lot of people are talking about this one now if we go to the news and we'll go to stock tweets should already be logged in I believe <clears throat> yeah I'm right here all right see we can we got all this stuff written and I know sometimes with our busy life, it gets a little crazy um, to see what's what. So, um, not just crazy about everything. So anyways, we can do that. Um, oh, yeah, all right. So that's another good thing. And we got the, we got the symbols right here that um, we can now this guy's saying AMD here. Everyone's been on AMD. $12 a share. To be honest with me, <coughs> I 
that stock is definitely a good one to buy for long term. And unfortunately, my that's a good one for long term. Um, but some people are just selling it. But mark my words, it's definitely one to watch. Um, the stock right here. They think you're roundabout company. This stock was in 2012 was trading for two dollars a share. It's up. So many people might want to short this stock. And now I didn't know nothing about short song. Good thing I saw a video um, about short selling. And I didn't know everything about when you short sell, the broker might have five people that got this stock and say they come out with a dividend and they give each shareholder 50 bucks a share. Well, first thing you gotta do is you gotta give him 50 bucks and then you can buy a stock from either one of these because your broker is judges. So you get the stock to say $15, uh, $13, you buy it for 13, you get it for 13, it drops down to five. You buy one share back, you keep the percentage of the stock and that's all fine and dandy. Depends on what stocks you're gonna short. You're definitely gonna short Google or IBM or something like that if you wanna short IBM. But you got to, whatever the dividends in. So I, I don't really know a lot about short selling. That's why I went to a particular place to find out. You know what I mean? And penny stocks is one penny to five dollars, not one penny to 40 or 50. But anyways, it's a little bit about short selling. And I'm going to kind of get into short selling and all that stuff. But I just wanted to explain to you. Short selling, you really got to know what you do. There are a lot of videos out there. I, I, I There's some good ones. Uh, definitely Tim Sykes has a lot of good videos on YouTube. Fuse4, he has a lot of good videos on YouTube. So there's a lot of knowledge on YouTube to use. It's just a matter of finding it. That's why I'm going to really start to work on playlists that are good and really focus on what's what and show you what stocks I'm going to follow for the day. But I definitely got to cut this video short because a lot of knowledge I don't want to hit you at once, okay? Going to show you some different things. So I'll be putting the link down for my website. Still under construction. Been under construction a while because that's what I do all the time. I'm all over the place with everything, with websites. But I definitely want to focus on this. I love TC2000. Did a lot. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. But this is a stock that's on everyone's watch list. Um, so I'm going to add it to mine. <clears throat> and to do that, you're just going to come down and... Where? Oh, I want to save it. No. Uh, I'll just do this in Berlin. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll just add it to Tuesday's watch list. That's what I'm gonna do. Well, it doesn't matter. You can save it after I real. Just wanted to show you guys that. <clears throat> and then let's go with TC2000. <clears throat> it gives you the stocks that are following that sector. Right there. So like if I want, I can flag that. Flag that. And flag that. <laughs> so, just want to tell you a little bit. So, short selling, really go know what you do. There are some videos out there. I do have some in my playlist. That's a particular video that somebody sent me. You know what I mean? Everyone running, you got too many Indians and not enough Chiefs. You, or you got too many Chiefs, not enough Indians. But that particular video is a pretty good one for that. Another tool I use is this sucker right here, which is an amazing tool. I found this on <clears throat> you know, a website. I found this with a couple of people that use it, and I was I knew about this sooner. And man, the first thing I should have done when I said, "Oh, you got to get this!" Like, I mean, as soon as I walked in, oh, Robin, here's some tools. Use them. And I wish I would have known about this, and I should have known about this, because I was in 
a particular place where this was available. And I'm looking through, coming, typing in something about fundamentals and Google and uh, uh, YouTube for searching. And I came across the, the, the person that actually made it. Then I had a couple other videos and stuff like that. But it's literally insane. But it's a good video. I'll leave the link below the description. I think I've done a video on it. But you can type in any symbol. And it's just a quick way to get the news. I mean, I, I, I think it's better than Finviz. But it's an awesome thing. I mean, uh, I just got to make it so it launches Internet Explorer. But, but yeah, it gives you everything. Right in the corner, it's quick, easy access. It gives you stock tw tweeter, which is nice. Finviz automatically. So it does kind of a variety of <coughs> using um, TC2000 for, and having the other features in, involved in it. So that's why I like, I got tweets. So like I already have a Finviz account and I already have one here. So basically it's nice to <coughs> do this one. I do have to open up a tweet account. I'm going to do that later. But I just wanted to share that with you. Enjoy everything. Remember, there's a lot of haters out there. So, hey, you know what? We all like what we like. We all do what we want to do. That's how we roll. That's how the cookie rolls. So, get everything set up. Hope to see you guys and girls in the chat room. Going to be working on that for a while. But I just want to do my own. I'm not going to. I want a place where people could come, hang out. Ask different questions. As a mentor says, the more people in the chat room, more people are looking for stocks. And yes, I always have the uh, <coughs> trade armor going. Um, so I'll, I'll throw that up for a little bit there, and we'll we'll get that going. This is a wonderful program. Like I said, I love it. It's worth 35 bucks. And actually, I believe it's on sale. Wish I can make a profit. Like, so I'll put these like how they have with T2000 where you can put, get a piece of the action. But yeah, good program. Enjoy. As you can see, the market's selling off like crazy, which is a good thing. But yeah, you can see all this action. So if I want to, I can come up here and go to a full chart. And there's a full chart there. Um, there's the NASDAQ. And then you got that. So I see, very cool. So, oh yeah, best program ever. Worth it. If you're gonna buy something, instead of getting Finviz, Put the money towards this best thing ever. I like using this. It's made me some money. Definitely keeps you in the market. Anyways, I'm going to do a little more focus on that. But that's one of the tools. But <coughs> this is when I show you how to find the different stocks. The top volume stocks for the day. And then these are the top gainers. You can do 90%. <coughs> it's all different codes. Like I said, the uh, other... Penny stock code, I told you, that's a good one too. You can tweak it. I'm going to make another good penny stock scanner. I'm going to do it today and I'm going to put that video up today. And then I'm going to go over a market recap on the other videos. But like I'm saying, so we're going to do a lot of that. So enjoy. Take it easy. And of course, here's some other. So you get all that stock market news. Number one, I can add this one, flag it. And just add all the ones that are interesting to me. And I know a lot of people are into this stock. But, yeah, so enjoy, enjoy this video. I got to run doctor appointments. Enjoy it. Leave any comments down below. And like everything else, ask questions. Five simple questions. Hey, I love to help people. I'm a gopher. I like to go on the internet, find something on YouTube, and post up. Can I do that? And say, hey... What else good? If you're good at penny stocks, you're good at penny stocks. 
damn, I met some wonderful girls that are good with the percentages and stuff, which is awesome that we got more women trading. It's always been a man's market dominating. But enjoy, ladies. Enjoy, boys and girls. Have a good time. God bless. I gotta go. Enjoy. Peace out.